um, what have you been up to since Mexico? No, not much. I uh, spent a couple of days here. Um, maybe the highlight yesterday, I went to see uh, Pedro Diniz, um, who obviously uh, disappeared from, uh, from Formula One a long time ago. But uh, yeah, I read a book and he was mentioned in the book and I, I found out about his project now and what he's doing. And uh, it was great to visit him at his farm and, and see his approach to farming, which is very different. And uh, yeah, I think uh, an approach that you know, does have a future. Um, so I think uh, it's, it's a great responsibility to grow food, but um, doing it the right way and giving something back, I think it's a, it's a great way to do it. So it was inspiring to see what he has achieved so far and to, to see you know, what, he's, what he's built. I think you're also very inspiring, Seb, because you're doing all this very quietly, quietly, without everybody having to shine the spotlight on you doing it. Would you agree with that? <laughs> I, I, I don't know, I guess I have to agree, but uh, I'm, I don't know, I'm doing, it, I'm doing it my way. I'm interested in lots of things and when I get to, you know, uh, get the chance to travel the world and see different places and meet different people and, uh, yeah, learn stuff, then I'm up for it. But uh, I know that nowadays it's the norm normally is to talk about everything that you do um, and I don't feel that urge. I never started it, so maybe that's why, but um, yeah, I'm happy to to talk to you about it when you ask me, but if you don't, then we can talk about something else as well. well that's wonderful. Um, let's talk about then this weekend here in Brazil uh, in terms of racing. Otmar said at the end of Mexico that you had strong race pace. Do you think that's going to translate into strong race pace here? We'll see. It's a bit different. The track's different. The conditions will be different. The uh, tarmac is very different, but mostly the altitude is different. We're still high up, but not as nowhere near as high as Mexico City. So. Uh, we will see, but I hope we, you know, we can carry that momentum into these last races and uh, I think there's some more points for us to score. Um, it's not like we can make huge progress in the Drivers' and the Constructors' Championship, but who knows, you know, if there's a chance to score big points, then we need to be there and, and, uh, and make sure we grab them before other people do. And the sprint, looking forward to it, have you, have you found them enjoyable this, weekend, this, yeah. this year? It depends how it goes for you. I mean, if it goes well, then it's really enjoyable. If it doesn't, then... You hate it, but uh, um, yeah, I think it's, you know, we see, this is a good track though for it. I think there's always stuff happening here and whether 24 laps is enough, we will see. We will. Thank you very much.